I made a lot of recommendations for the mill deck list as the meta evolves and especially in the scam meta game it's hard to find a way to really solidify yourself against the deck and I think you know what the main list of mill is fine you know you go like the three Tasha's for fractured you know period and all that stuff you just have to hope to find you know well not get double scammed and then you get there but the rest of the meta game you can actually relatively attack with a simple surgical extraction a lot of the times there are one to two cards that become problematic in that situation. For example, depending on what your opponent has played through one, two, three, you know what they're generally building up to and what you're going to lose to. So you're going to hope to surgical that and then work your way through other uh, problematic cards that come up. And especially against Living End, a matchup that I've showcased so much on this channel as to why it's, it's such a, a buy, almost against playing like Tron or Amulet. Because, well, the deck has living in and they really keep it in their deck so it's not like they're just going to cast it it's going to go in their graveyard and we can respond to it but because the amount of searchers in the deck especially with the uh, lord of the rings kind of uh, cyclers coming out it's so simple to enable archive trap and they kind of have to a lot of the times they usually keep like one or two landers because they're like 14 land decks now no it's very rare that they have the full suite so you're going to see in this game a match that happens so fast and i don't even feel bad for them they're playing cascade they're playing the combo decks out there and these are the type of decks that mill can feast on so i hope you enjoy the surgical extraction madness and just remember honestly this card will probably never leave the 75 of any mill deck, even if it's extra pay. I'm finally on the damn play in this league. And this hand, I'll have to function. It's got the removal. There's an opportunity to potentially use the Visions of Beyond. I will play a Polluted Delta and pass. Just hopefully this isn't a main board Blood Moon type of problem because this basic swamp is kind of annoying. Okay. All right, then we'll, then we'll fetch accordingly. Watery Grave tapped. What was my opponent got? Honestly, I'm thinking like Living End. That's all this Misty Rainforest says to me. Another Fractured Sandy is actually nice. I'm going to... If I'm thinking multicolor, then I do want the Field of Ruins. Uh, but it means I'm casting Fractured Sandy like a lot later. I think is fine. Uh, keep the fractured sanity on top. Uh, play that out. Let's see what they do. Let's see what they do. Hopefully, it's like some type of combo. If it's a living end, like we have a pretty good start off of them. We'll do this. Okay. Okay. All right. Well, I don't. This is living end. I was gonna say I don't exactly know if it's living end, but I it's living end. Okay. Bring up your lands, that's fine. Yep. They're like thinking about forcing it, I guess. Yep. So they got 15 cards in there. Um, they'll put two more in there. That's how they combo off at least so it's not it's not ideal so yeah here's the problem with my lands right now i can't i can't cycle fractured and cast blue okay mountain cycling for the oliphant okay so there's 17 cards in there i can't get a third in there um i am playing main board surgical here so there is a living in there i have Okay, this isn't this isn't ideal. This isn't ideal. Like they're gonna they're gonna wait until my turn to go off. Cause they have the third land, right? Yeah. I just have to hope they don't have the, the thing. Yeah, okay. All right, good. So I can stop the first instance, which is nice. So you put the living end on the stack. I can drown the living end. Undo. Drown the living end, which is great. This can't be forced. Pass right through. Okay. Um, it's a little better. Did I take out their basic forest? Did not. Okay, so we're going to fetch for a basic island. 
Uh, we'll cycle. Right? Oh my. So that's three copies of Living End in there. We'll cast Push here. And... I think I wait on the Visions because they could force it. And I need Visions to resolve if I'm going to try and steal this game one. It's good that we were able to get that that shardless out because now they're they have to be a bit more proactive. They have to establish a threat. They have to do things, uh, which is always nice. Sure. Get a steam vents. I only played the breeding pool. So in this case, we're going to respond to this. We're going to draw three. Problem is they got a grief in the yard. If they didn't have grief, this would actually be fine. Uh, but I'm gonna archive trap in response because maybe I mill out the the other living end. Uh, that's the idea here. So the trap is actually not bad. See what we get though. Mill out the living end. It's 50-50 essentially. Oh, oh my god! Let's go! I milled out the living end. All four living ends are gone. One, two, three, four. Let's go. Oh, let's go. Come on. This deck ain't got nothing on us. Let's go. Okay, that was a pretty, pretty stellar win. I'm a, I'm a big fan. So ideally we're bringing all that stuff in first. So we're going to take out the fatal pushes. Start there. Um... I think subtlety is kind of kind of weird. Not gonna lie. Gonna take out. If I'm gonna take a like, if I'm gonna bring in all this graveyard hate, take out the visions, and then we can sub out like one Jace. Um. Yeah, I think that's good from there. Uh, we'll run it like this. Yeah, J. And then like, if obviously if we get past the need for requiring graveyard hey we have jace to potentially draw three if we get into a, some type of mid game with them uh the nuts okay yeah this is great we're gonna keep this against living end we will definitely keep an archive trap into double surgical extraction let's go generous ant start it off search your library pass priority i'm gonna cast this archive trap mill over living end all right, Living End is there on your turn. Go to combat first, just in case. I'm going to cast Surgical Extraction on the Living End. Did you swap into Rhinos? You did not swap into Rhinos. Let's go. <laughs> Yo, it's too easy. Living End taking the L. It's too easy. I'm telling you, the mill matchup versus Living End is unmatched. Living End has no game versus us. That goes for all graveyard decks, too.